Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So as most of you know, bone right now is at very, very low levels. Okay, so of course that is going to create a lot of division within the community it's normal okay you're going to get all the fudders then you're going to get all those that uh probably don't even say a word they're just loading up because they're like wow this is crazy this is just an absolute dream for us this is cheap with a shibarium with an upcoming bull run that's about to happen in a few months so of course they're excited beyond beyond anything but you know the um Regular person still finds it hard to kind of make a decision, okay, because at the end of the day, you know, they, they understand there's a long-term plan, but when you don't see it with the price action, some people may think it's not possible, okay, because they're like, wow, look, look, look at these, look at this low level, look at these negative candles, okay, uh, so when I say negative candles, okay, let me just click on them. Look at this, the negative candles, red candles. Oh my God, it's the end of it. Let, let me just, uh, you know, completely give up. Let me come out with a loss. It's over, blah, blah, blah. You know, and I, and I get it. I get it, okay? There's a lot of rookie investors. Eventually, they'll learn the lesson. I mean, when Bone does go up in price, when we see the bull run, when things start really kicking off, they will learn, they will understand. But as of now, it's very difficult for a lot of them to actually you know, get it. They just don't get it. That's the thing. But, um, you know, it's very um, important for me to make this video because I got to address the fudders and I got to make you understand that fudders also uh, are very divided community. Um, and I would call them a community because there's a lot of them and it seems like, you know, uh, fudders can actually create pages. They can get together and actually absolutely just uh bs or all over um the tokens okay that they don't like and it can be for several reasons one obviously is the most common one where you know people are generally upset you know that like i've mentioned before the rookie rookies the those that are very impulsive emotional that shouldn't really be even investing but they get into investing because they are attracted by you know the idea of a 24 hour you know flip meaning in 24 hours you become a millionaire they're also very very um excited when they see graphs like the 2001 uh i think it was about november where you know things were really pumping where things were really going um shiba inu created millionaires billionaires and so on so many other tokens did so well and that created a lot of article there was a lot of talk about it i get it i get it uh, and this is again one of the things that a lot of people fall for but if we were to be very um realistic okay we were to be very very realistic guys let's let's open our eyes some whales and some individuals out there are going to be making a lot of money and you know it you know it guys you know they are prepared to wait it out they're prepared you know to actually see a drop and they will be loading up like no tomorrow so for them it's almost even beneficial for there to be fud you know it's beneficial for there to be uh, a lot of negative energy because that's going to push down the price and guess what people selling out are out that's pushing the price down and when it goes down to the golden golden numbers like say for example 0 0.3 guess what's going on they're loading up like no tomorrow okay they're getting those bags nice and heavy because they would rather you know get it at very cheap prices because they know how much they could make out of it simple as that guys i've told you many times uh, many that were listening to my videos back in the days when it was at 0 0.3 guess what even with this these these low prices you're still doubling your pro uh, your money I mean, it really is crazy to think that, but it's so true. It really is true that, uh, you know, there are those um, behind the scenes that are quietly, you know, I call them the quiet assassins that are loading up those bags. Uh, they are, they could even be themselves just promoting this FUD, this crap, 
uh, that gets uh, some people to sell off, you know, um, not really understanding why they're doing it, just based on the fact that they see a low price right now. I've seen this, I've seen this, guys. Uh, and I know it and and you know these type of uh, communities out there are very strong and they're happy when uh, you know people panic why why do you think for example Shiba Inu has whales you know that are holding millions and millions of dollars of Shiba Inu why because they know they know this thing is gonna eventually pop off and that's gonna make them some crazy amounts of money crazy unimaginable amounts of money and Bone as well has some serious holders out there. And they're DCAing, uh, they're loading up their bag, they've got their plan, and they don't care what you guys even think about this. They couldn't care less because they are interested in their own objectives and their own plans. And they know the plan is very strong here. We've got a, uh, we've got a team, okay, that is active. This isn't just some social media personality or some celebrity out there just promoting one token and it just goes up uh, just because you know of some tweet. No, it's not that. Not how it works. There's real developments here. There's a layer two solution. Exchanges are listing it. Um, you know, many things are coming in. Big projects are uh, going to be uh, integrating, partnering, diving in. I mean, that is great, and that is exactly what we want to see what we want to be part of i'm so uh, tired of, of people not understanding that it's not all you know just beautiful roses uh and it's gonna be seen that way it's not like you know we just uh see prices grow and you just jump in and you make your money and you come out and that's it you never have to work that's not how it works guys most investments you gotta buy the dips you gotta wait it out you gotta Go through all the fud, the crap. You've mentioned it many times and hopefully it can stick in your heads and you can get a better understanding on how this all works. And I can't wait uh, to be, you know, making the, the right um, uh, decision, you know, to actually uh, keep keep going with this and, and uh, showing you how uh, this is going to be done because in the future, when the bull run happens, okay, we get a lot of money coming in, when we get the bigger uh, exchanges listing it, pr obviously price is going to be higher. So then, then we could talk about cashing out some, okay, some of that bone. But now, don't panic, don't freak out. We have so much more to achieve, so much more needs to be done. It is the moment of truth. Can you wait it out or can you not? The year is ending and remember, Worst case scenario, if you were to, for example, buy this dip, you'd see, you'd see somewhere, you know, around this. Because uh, if you look at the max chart, guys, it's always peaking, dipping, peaking, dipping, peaking, uh, dipping, peaking, dipping. So we're in a dip, and this dip just looks like, you know, it's gonna finish sometime soon, very soon. Could take a few more weeks, but then it could go up. And guess what? Best case scenario, this chart is absolutely blown up, okay? We could be seeing a $50 and $100 chart. Uh, people are very optimistic. Uh, those that understand, those that know how to invest, uh, those that see the fuller picture, they're on board for sure, okay? So as of now, guys, um, just want to say that if you have any thoughts in regards uh, to all that FUD, all the negative uh, news that has been going on, let us know down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe, turn that notifications bell on, and as usual, guys, a big thank you to everyone. I appreciate all the support, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.